Hi everyone. So my name is Gaurav and you are watching Step Campus. In this video, we are going to start our T12 courses for the Wings 1 exam. So T12 courses, I will let you know some basic information about. So T12 courses are going to be a automation testing courses uh, where Selenium with Java. Okay. Second one, Nightwatch, and third one, Cucumber. That is a framework of Selenium. Uh, they are going to ask us in the exam. So I am just making this tutorials for the night watch later on after completing night watch I will start uh, selenium with java and after complete the selenium java we will see selenium with uh, selenium bdd uh, framework okay so let's start about the night watch first so like what is night watch so night watch js is an open source automation testing framework okay which is used for the web application testing okay we have a websites so for websites we have some write some code to test the website so we are using night walls to automate this one selenium is also the same thing okay selenium also we are using selenium web driver to automate our test results so here also we are doing the same but this is a new tools we can say to automate those web applications okay it allows developers to write end-to-end -end test tests. So what is end-to-end -end test test? We are going to see further slides. Okay. In now we can see this. Th this is uh, used to write end-to-end -end test tests in JavaScript. Actually, Selenium we can uh, connect with Java, Python, Ruby, etc. Right. But for the night watch, uh, we have a limitation. Like we have to use a JavaScript. Okay. So it's a JavaScript based automation testing tool to test the web applications okay so now let's move to the next slide see what we have so we have a features of night watch so let's see what is the features of the night watch okay so first i talk about the end-to-end -end testing which we have seen just now so what does end-to-end -end means so end-to-end -end means like we we have many uh we can see there are many interactions interactions like uh, action button clicking send keys okay uh, we have drop and down double click so there are so many interaction we can found on the web page so uh, night watch gives us end-to-end -end testing okay we can do all the things what we want from the night watch okay second thing javascript based as i already told you night watch is a java based test script okay so we have to if we have to write a test script then we have to write in the J a javascript uh, language only okay it's a very uh, easy one i will when i will start actual testing now then we will see there how to test these things with the help of javascript so it's a very easy one i say now we have third one the selenium web driver integration as you all know about the selenium if not then i will going to start a lecture of this one also in some upcoming days but yeah as for example we can see the selenium web driver so what this selenium web driver will do now it will face the data from the user machine okay so suppose you have written some code you will run that code okay then selenium what driver what it will do it will do as a mediator it will take your code it is convert to the web based uh, language and it will interact with the web browsers suppose we have written a code for the chrome driver so it will face your code it will move to the chrome driver and it will it will uh, do the actions what you have given in the code okay and again it will gives you a response okay so this is the use of selenium web driver so it is integrated with the selenium web driver okay fourth one simple and expressive syntax so nightwatch js provided a straightforward and expre expressive syntax for the writing test okay uh, we will see in the uh, upcoming lecture like how to write so it's a very uh, like how we are writing in english now it is same like uh, same like that way only okay if we write like to be visible so we have a command here to be visible to see the uh, element is visible or not so it's a very easy one okay we will see uh, this is a theoretical part that's why we are not getting all the things but yeah when we start our uh, testing actual testing uh, lecture technical details then we can see there okay now fifth one asynchronous test execution what does it means so i have written here so nightwatch js support asynchronous text execution means allowing test to interact with the web applications and wait for certain condition to be met before proceeding means this application this automation tool will wait to the element until this element will present 
and then after meeting the condition it will move further okay but yeah here also an exception like it will wait for minimum 5 seconds okay if we haven't used any wait condition or any implicit explicit wait okay so a synchronous like it will wait for that time duration by default and if the element will present then it will uh, click that element or do whatever uh, actions so we have suggested to do if not then it will fail okay and give us an error like this element didn't, didn't found or anything what we have uh, given the condition at the time okay now configuration and setup so night watch is very easy to set up okay uh, this one also i can show you but not in this lecture because this is an introduction lecture only so it's a very easy to set up okay i will show you how to set up the night watch and how to start testing now reporting and logging so night watch also provide detailed reporting and logging features okay where we can see our test result in a documented format okay so that we can troubleshoot if any discrepancy will occur okay so overall if i conclude this all the points so we'll un un conclude like that night watch js is a simple simplify the process of automation testing for web application by providing a robust framework okay with powerful features as we see like what are the features of this one and also cross browsing capability okay and developer friendly approach so this is the overall of nightwatch so it's an introduction lecture this is only about uh, what is nightwatch so you can download this slide i will give this slide uh, in the description book you can download and you can read from your end but yeah actual if you say actual testing of nightwatch you will start in upcoming lecture where i will let you know how to install the night watch how to install ide because we require ide also to write us some codes okay so we are using visual code and night watch uh, in the uh, upcoming lecture so meanwhile you can subscribe my channel okay and then we'll see you in the next lecture thank you guys thank you all